Dan's got to be having flashbacks. I don't know if Van Dam realizes it just yet. I think now Van Dam sees it. Swing and a miss with Janice. Abyss locked with the chair. Got cold call big time. Well, Rob, about the, I think Rob, I, know, I think Rob looked down and I believe, I think Rob, Mike, is uh, looking at, at Janice, yeah. Why the hell not? Well, the old cliche, the old expression, turnabout's fair play. Would never be more appropriate than oh, right oh, now. God. Never good. RVD gonna try and put him away and still can't do it. Tell you what, a lot of intestinal fortitude, toughness shown by Jerry Lynn, able to kick out. He about got pasted with that chair kick by uh, Van Dam. I gotta tell you, watching this and being here where we are, it's like I'm going back in time. What the hell's going on? <laughs> Well, Taz is in the time warp. <laughs> and you know what? You may see something that you've seen before also right here. Oh my God. Just lay out and let it happen. I mean, that, that's, Jer that, that would be coast to coast. Gonna try and mount an offensive here. My, after everything that he's gone through, quickly reversed off, puts on the brakes. Oh. Whoa! Well, you gotta give Sabu credit. He, oh look at that! He pushed the rim out of the way, and Abyss goes face first, body first, right into the barbed wire table. He's stuck there. He's stuck into it. And you can see Mitchell screaming at him, but what can Abyss do? Nothing. He's, you're right, Don. He's got nowhere to go because he's stuck right against that barbed wire board. Oh, he kicked ah! on top of the other. Oh, man. He's sandwiched no, between no. them. Pin, this two. Is, oh, please, somebody end it. The winner of Barbed Wire Messenger, oh. Sabu. My word, a picture's worth a thousand words right there. There is just no way. The crowd yelling, Sabu is one. He took so much. Oh my, somebody get that off of him. He's stuck on. Oh, he's sandwiched in between the barbed wire boards. And look at Sabu put the boots to him after he's already won the barbed wire massacre. Uh, it's, just, it's just emotion right now. It's adrenaline. Sabu is springs off the rope. Oh! And mighty, twisting DDT head first goes Van Dam right into the chair. Could this be enough? That might be enough. Sabu for the cover. Finnegan counts two. 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 Sabu, multi-time world champ in the original era, defeating Shane Douglas for the title one time, Terry Funk the other, as he goes air. Oh, oh God. And Van Dam has just been drilled several times 
somehow, some way, with a chair near his face and head. Leg drop in the chair. Arm extended and draped over the chest of Van Dam, and again, too. And you know, look, Van Dam's got to defend his TNA World title in four days uh, on Spike TV and a whole effing show against the Monster Abyss in the Stairway to Janice match. That sick weapon that Abyss has. I mean, that's how just how that, that, one of the things you concentrate on a night like this, and you don't take into account the schedule that, that Van Dam has had appearing on, on Impact this past Thursday. Like Taz says, what he's got lined up with the oh. is That time he just got out of the way. Well, watch Van Dam. A oh, five star at the top. Hook in the head, got a cradle, he's got a cradle there. What a match. Ladies and gentlemen, your winner of the match, the whole epic show, Rob Van Dam. Pretty cool to see. Still hurting. You see Sabu still hurting. But he insisted on making sure that he raised the hand of RVD in victory.